What is up everybody? How is it going? Welcome to the Ecom Hunt YouTube channel. Nice to see you here. My name is Sherban and in this video I'm going to show you the three main types of ads that you could use for your Facebook ads with all of their advantages and disadvantages. Without further ado, let's get started. The first ad type that we are going to talk about in today's video are the single image ads. Why have I picked them? Well, mainly because they are really easy to use, they are beginner friendly, all of the beginners tend to use this type of ad because it's more convenient to them, they are really too easy to use and uh, you see them pretty often, you see them once in a while when you scroll on your Facebook news feed, every once like 6 or 8 posts you see a single image ad and you are pretty familiar with it. I'm going to show you how does a single image ad look like in, a, in after two slides. Uh, they have a few advantages and disadvantages, so let's talk about that. Uh, their biggest advantage is that they take up the biggest part of the screen. This is the biggest ad type that you can use on Facebook. And that's amazing because when you are competing for ad space, you're basically uh, looking for real estate. You're paying for real estate. And it's amazing to know that you can pay the same price for a single image ad uh, as for a carousel ad, for example. When you... Uh, when a single image ad gives you like the the big majority of the screen when when people see it so it's it's really nice to use it for high quality photos because uh, you only get one chance to attract your customer and uh, you only have one photo to show them uh, they are really easy and fast to make we have talked about is they are really beginner friendly uh, their disadvantages is that you can only show one picture to convince your potential customer to click on your ad so that's it you only get one chance. Show them the picture and if they like the picture, if they are attracted to it, they will click on the ad. If not, they will not. You don't have any more chances like uh, these other ad types that we are going to talk about. Uh, you must engage with your audience. This is an advantage because uh, the post is so big and uh, the action button is so small, a lot of people tend to uh, not observe it, to not notice the, the action button. The button that says shop now or buy now something like that uh, they will not see it and they will ask in the comments where can I buy this and you must always engage with them you must always respond to those types of question and always provide the link to the product and and tell them where can they find the product you must always use a link in description so people will uh, will notice it better, right? These are the advantages and the disadvantages uh, you choose uh, if you wanna use the single image ads for your store. Uh, this is how a single image ad looks like and this is how it is divided. Uh, it has a text, it has an image, it has a headline, a description and a action button, right? This is how you can use a single image ad. Next up, we have carousel ads. You know those ads that you can like scroll with your thumb on the phone or even click on the, the, the next arrow if you're on a de desktop version. Uh, they ha also have a few advantages and disadvantages. Their biggest advantage is that you can showcase up to 10 products in only one ad. In the same space that you're using for, I don't know, for a normal ad, you can show 10 products, right? This is a really good deal. You're not wasting money on 10 different ads, you're wasting money only on one ad. Well, you're not wasting the money, you're spending money only on one ad and you can show up to 10 products. You can all, uh, you can show the same product if you want to from different angles, but it is uh, like the best use of the carousel ad is to show uh, more products in the same real estate space. They cost the same as any other ad. Um, you can see which product and which card gets more likes and you can scale from that on. If you see that you have 10 products and only the product number 7 got the most of the likes, you know that people and people like and people are attracted uh, about uh, people tend to like that product more and you will take product number 7 and make a separate ad for it or you put it the first one so people will see the first one. Uh, another advantage is that you can uh, you will have an action button on every card. When you scroll on them, you will have the shop now or buy now button on every card, every one of the 10 cards and uh, people will see it. It'll, it will be more visible than the single image ad. Another advantage of the carousel ad is that you can show every card with a different type of message and different type of picture, right? So every card can be customized. This is amazing 
because uh, you can change the headline, you can change the price, you can change the subheadline, the title, you can change anything you want in any card. You don't have to have all of the cards the same and uh, that's, that's a plus for variety, right? The disadvantages of the carousel ads. They are a few, but they are worth mentioning, right? The first one is that they take a smaller space on the screen. They are not that visible as the single image ads. For example, uh, the real estate that you're buying, it's way smaller than the single image ad. Um, the second one is that you have a lot of work to put in if you want good results, because you have to customize each and every card that you have with pictures, links, description, everything. Right, uh, it's like doing the same thing that you're doing for a single image ad 10 times if you want to get results, right? So basically, if you want to have only one product and if you only want to use one image to promote that product, that's fine. You can use a single image ad. If you want to showcase more products and each and every product will have a different link to your website, a different picture, a different description and a different price, I would recommend you to use carousel ads. Uh, this is how a carousel ad looks like. I found this example. This is really, really uh, like visual example of a carousel ad. I'm sure that you are encountering them every day. They are really popular nowadays. Last but not least, we have the video ads. In my opinion, the video ads are the only type of ad that don't have any kind of disadvantage at all. They only have advantages. And I would highly advise you to use video ads as much as possible and if you have like material if you have videos to use use them uh, and uh, pick video ads before uh, single image ad and carousel ads anytime right so the advantages is that you have an amazing conversion rate and this is due to the fact that uh, people are are really entertained when they are watching a video and people tend to stop when they are scrolling on Facebook way more times uh, on a video ad that they are doing on a sing single image ad, for example. They have amazing impression per click rate. It means that uh, the rate of people that uh, get delivered the, your ads and uh, the people that actually click on your ad, it's, a re it's really big. It's way bigger than a single image ad and a carousel ad because basically this is... Uh, what I just told you, a video ad, it's way more entertaining than a still image. Uh, you can show a product from multiple angles in a moving and interactive way. You don't just pick one picture from one angle and the other one showing uh, the other angle. You can show a 360 video, a 180 video. You can show uh, an ambiental video of the product being used. I don't know, it depends on what your, I don't know, what your creative input is. Um, easy to scale. They are really, really easy to scale because Facebook gives you the option to know how many people have watched uh, certain percentages of your video. So if your video is uh, one minute long, let's say that uh, you can select only people that have watched more than 50 seconds of your ad or, or that have watched all of your ad or the, the one minute entirely. You know that they are interested. You can retarget them and uh, video ads are really nice and easy to scale and they are the most interactive way you can display an ad. Uh, this is it for the video ads. I'm gonna show you as a bonus, I'm gonna show you an example of a video ad that we're doing at a, a Facebook page that we're having. We have a store that sells a uh, case for all types of cards and we have ran an ad for, for that store, a video ad. I'm gonna show you that video ad just to give you an idea how should a video ad look like. Alright guys, so this is how a video ad should look like 
We have not worked a lot of time on this. It, it's really easy to make if you have the product uh, and it will be, I promise it will be a hundred times better if you have the material to use for a video ad than uh, a single image ad. You're probably wondering how did we know what product to sell? Where did we know, where did we got the idea to sell that particular product that we use the video ads on, like the, the card case? Well, we did it by ourselves. Uh, we did it with the help of an amazing website. It is called Ecom Hunt. You have a link in the description. Please click it to check it out. This is how Ecom Hunt looks like. Uh, you have here a lot of products. These are all winning products. These are products that are making waves on the market and they are ideal to drop ship. They are cool products. People really love them and uh, we have an amazing team that's searching for these products 24 seven and they are providing you with two new products every day. Uh, as you can see, every product has its own section. You can click on the product and you will find information about it. You will find pictures, videos of the product. You can import it to your store directly. You can see how many stores are selling the product and you can even spy on those stores to see which stores are selling it and how do the ads look like. Uh, you can uh, click here and find it on AliExpress, for example, so you know where you get it from. You can see the price, you can see everything about any product that you see here on Ecomon. It's an amazing tool and I strongly recommend you to use it. Uh, again, click the link in the description and uh, you can sign up with us, you will not regret it. Once again, thank you for watching. I hope this video has helped you a lot and these were the three uh, most used ad types and I hope you get the idea for uh, what each and every ad type does and how can you use it in your best advantage. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to support us and uh, to encourage us to make more material just like this one. Thank you for watching. See you next week.